I haven't really, I haven't made any videos about a Hellboy on this channel, and I hadn't planned to, but this photo looks so amazingly good, I couldn't help myself. Yesterday, Entertainment Weekly posted the first official look at David Harbour of Stranger Things fame. He plays the sheriff on that show, but of course David Harbour has been working, he's an experienced actor, so you've probably seen his face in other stuff, in his Hellboy getup. And this is a fantastic picture. I mean, I will, you're going to be surprised to hear this. I didn't see any of the old Hellboy movies <laughs> with um, Ron Perlman. I know everybody, when I say that, they are stunned. Like, you haven't seen Hellboy? No, I haven't. And I haven't read any of the comic books. I know doubly shocked, right? But of course I know who Hellboy is. And I know he already had some movies that, you know, were successful. I think people like those movies, right? I mean, they definitely have a fan base. But um, I just couldn't help it. I had to comment on this because I just think he looks basically like... I've seen pictures of Hellboy like on comic book covers in the store. And I know this to me is like the spirit of the character, what I've seen. I know his horns are like, they're not, they're sawed off or whatever or cut. I don't know what the storyline reason is. Like I said, I haven't read Hellboy comics, but I know his horns on his head, they aren't like, they aren't complete. But here I guess they're making them complete. Long and sharp, but... He looks like a demon from hell. I mean, if I were to see a demon from hell or from some other realm in the real life, this is what I would envision. I mean, this kind of demon, you know. He's red, muscular, he's surrounded by fire. Well, actually, a lot of demons necessarily in, like, you know, biblical, and they're not all, like, muscular. Some of them are, like, you know, have big bellies and stuff. They have hooves or whatever. But basically, he looks like what a demon could look like. I'm not saying they couldn't look like this. He has a flaming sword. He looks like he's ready, you know, like a demon with a flaming sword. Isn't that something that you could imagine like a D&D &D game or in a fantasy novel or something or a video game, like a Forgotten Realms video game or a Witcher or something? I don't know. Whatever, whatever video game would have a demon with a sword, Diablo. I mean, a role-playing game. He just looks absolutely, in my opinion, fantastic. Now, let me just go over what we see. I talked about the horns and the fact he looks very buff in shape. I wonder if that's all David Harbour. Like, you know, he just worked out, they hooked him with a trainer. Or if he's wearing, like, kind of a prosthetics or whatever. Um, it doesn't matter, though. He looks great. Now, you can't tell because of the face. That doesn't look like David Harbour to me because they probably put a lot of prosthetics and stuff and makeup and stuff. I mean, that could be, like, a lot of guys under there. But he looks great. Like, the really, like strong defined you know jaw coming out you know all the hair on the side of the face you know the glowing eyes you can't they look beady although i think it's because of the shadow because he has his brows and his forehead come out kind of far it's just the kind of face either he has naturally david harbour or the way they've made him up but you know i think behind those dark black shadows on his eyes i think his eyes are wider but we can only see like a tiny red speck because of the angle and the shadowing very strong face you know, to go with the strong body. Like, this is a guy who can mean business. And, of course, he's carrying a giant sword, and he's a demon, so, of course, he means business. He's got, you know, the the hand, the metal hand. I guess, does, in the, in the storylines, does Hellboy get his hand chopped off, and they have to put on, like, a prosthetic or, like, a metal limb or whatever to make up for it? Or is it a glove? Does Hellboy wear a metal glove on one arm? Or is that his actual arm? And you can't see the bottom of him because... Oh wait, that's, is that, is this supposed to be blood mixed with fire? Because that's liquid looking. I assumed it was fire, but maybe it's supposed to be, you know, artistically blood and it blends into flame. Maybe he's actually surrounded by blood in the whole picture and only the, the flame, only the sword is what's on fire. Or maybe I'm overthinking it, but whatever. It's just, it's fantastic. I love it. Um, I was going to see this movie anyway. But um, this makes me more excited to see it. April 12th can't come out fast enough, soon enough. I will be there. What do you think? Are you impressed with this picture? Are you like, nah? Because, <laughs> you know, movies like sci-fi, fantasy, and comic book movies come out all the time. And TV shows come out all the time nowadays. So people are, I think, a bit more difficult to impress than maybe they would be if, you know, it was the old days when a comic book movie was more of a rarity. Or a TV show, you know, more of a rarity. But I'm sold. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please like it on YouTube and subscribe to the channel because I appreciate your viewership and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.